Okay, hi everyone. So this particular video is showing you our new feature, which is a summary report. And you can access that via the completed reports section. So if I just click on completed reports here, um, you'll see that we've got this summary report on the far left hand side. Now everyone, most of our users that will be really very familiar with the full report. So that's that's never been changed. That's always been there in the over the years, but we kind of literally just re renamed that full report. So that's the uh, comprehensive report of all the optional pages that you pick and choose that you want in there. So this summary report here, now we've got this extra functionality where you can add the uh, another theme. So different types of themes. Um, now I've got these two themes I've, I've built in here, but I'll, first of all, I just wanted to sort of just go through creating a theme first um, and then you can see the kind of the results okay so if I click on create theme uh, here and if I just type in uh, just gonna type in demo 2 and the base color so um, I'm gonna go to say like something like gray like that and then click on this line color here and this sort of change it to something like I'll tell you what let's change it a little bit kind of green like that there we go, leave it on that. And if I go to add new theme, um, I can click that to um, uh, close that there. And I've got my, my three different themes here. So I'm assuming most of, the, most of you will actually want a, a theme that is very similar to your logo. So it's easy to, to customize that. So um, in order to download a summary report, I can pick and choose which report I want to download. Um, so in this case, I want to do this Whitney demo 56. So what I'm going to do is click on summary report. It's processing. It doesn't take too long. And in a minute, you'll see exactly what you get in there. So there we go. So we have a by default, it's our logo in the top left hand corner. But of course, your logo will appear in the center here. Um, heat, heat loss summary as a title. You've got project reference, the heat source type, and also the uh, the installation address as well. So I just sort of zoom out a little bit more so you can see a little bit more of that. So let's go scroll down here, and then you can see summary of results. We've got total heat loss required to heat the building must provide an output of 3.71 kilowatts at the ex uh, for the outside external design temperature. So it's kind of similar, you know, for the first couple of pages for from the full report. Um, oh, the the theme, the kind of whole theme. These these are the colours that I changed. So this is the stuff that you can easily change um, in your customised theme. Scroll down. So the heat loss. So again, because it's a summary, we're just showing the room names. Uh, and the various parameter results for those rooms. And if I scroll down further, we we'll see radiators and emitters, the current radiators and emitters this is. So one of the things which we've listened to feedback is that in, in most cases, um, if you're gonna give this summary report to, to a homeowner, all you're really interested in is giving, is like listen to your feedback, is that you want to provide an overall summary of the heat loss for each room, and of course the property and then what emitters are currently installed and what emitters you're proposing to change out or even leave in as well so we've got um, current emitters here um, and we, we're using the custom mean water defined temperature as well so that's on the far right hand side and you can see that because we've we've specified a heat pump here with a flow temperature of 45 degrees um, then uh, the the current emitters aren't suitable for this lower flow temperature and, and change in delta T. So clearly current radiators um, aren't, aren't performing or certainly won't perform for this new uh, installation. So if we scroll down, now we're onto the proposed emitters. So this proposed emitters, we can see it's all gone green, which is great. So now we know that these particular radiators are, are, are actually going to uh, meet the demand for the lower flow temperature from this air source heat pump. Uh, and I can see, in fact, for the kitchen here, we've got we're leaving one K two in there, so we've got current. In, in, if I just zoom in a minute, you can see that a bit better. So you can see currently we've got that radiator in there. And if I scroll down again, um, what we're doing is we're highlighting any radiators. So in the living room here, any radiators that aren't going to be moved, um, we we put it in brackets of, of current. And then here we've got some thermoskirt um, product here as well to complement the existing radiator. Um, and so this client is going to be um, happy because now our, our new proposed uh, radiators, our, our emitters, I should say, are, are actually going to meet the demand there. So that's the that's the uh, that's the, the uh, example for the uh, summary report. Let's go to the top. Let's go back to the window again. 
And just to show you how easy it is to fluctuate between the, the different themes, so if I click on that one there, theme there, click download summary here. I'm sure you'll you'll get this, but just wanted to show you anyway, just to show you how easy it is to have the different themes. So scroll down again, and there we go. We've got our other different sort of theme here as well. So we've got the, the base color here and also the line color. So that's what, when you're going to change the themes here, I'm going to click on create simplified PDF theme here. So you've got base color here and line color, and that associates with, um, whoops, sorry, and that associates with this base color being blue and then the line color orange. So feel free to customize that for your own, you know, uh, to match your company logo um, theme as well. So yeah, hopefully you'll um, you'll enjoy uh, using that particular feature and uh, look out for some more. There's plenty more to come, plenty more features on the horizon there. Thanks.